The first one is actually myself, um, a better version of myself. So I guess when I'm swimming, I always want to, I'm inspired to be a better, better version of myself. Um, and then my first sort of idol in, in my swimming career was actually a Kiwi swimmer, Moss Burmester. Uh, he was our best turn about a flyer and he got fourth in Beijing. Um, and that was sort of when my dream started. Um, it's pretty, I like to think it's pretty basic um, and pretty flexible. Obviously when you're in a big competition, a lot can go wrong and a lot can change. Um, but obviously making sure I'm eating at the right time, stretching at the right time, um, and then putting my race suit on at least 20 minutes before my race. Um, those are sort of the, the basic of my pre-race ritual. <laughs> music changes all the time. Um, when I'm away, it's usually New Zealand music. Um, sort of takes me back home and motivates me to, you know, do my country proud. Yeah. Probably pasta, anything pasta with some, yeah, some nice cheesy sauce. <laughs> series probably will be the Marvel series. Um, I just read enough books to probably give you my favorite book, but Marvel series is my favorite, probably Iron Man. Probably when I made my first New Zealand team um, for the Commonwealth Games back in 2018. That was probably a highlight for me because I wasn't originally selected on the team. Um, and then when I didn't get selected, uh, it was a pretty cool feeling. It was, I was the first one in my family to, to go to a Commonwealth Games or Olympic Games. But, um, probably the, any, any 400 medley set, it's my, probably my hardest set is a 4 100s freestyle on 130. 400 freestyle, um, 445, and then 4 100s IM, and then 4 in IM, like times 3, I think. That's probably the hardest one I've done. I think coming back from the Olympics, that was, that was a tough one. Getting back into the routine of swimming again and motivating myself to, to go again. That was, I didn't think it was going to be that hard, and everyone had warned me that it was going to be hard coming home from the Olympics, but. Um, I think I did a pretty good job, but yeah, that was probably the hardest moment in my swimming career. Had a good time. Uh, you know, I'm pretty lucky we're here in Mallorca, we're having a fun time, and when I'm having fun, I'm swimming fast. And so if I can give any advice to anyone, I know it's pretty, you know, everyone knows that they should be having fun, but I think quite often people forget. And, you know, when I'm swimming fast, I'm having fun, so yeah. Um, I guess the people, you know, everyone's super nice here, everyone's super welcoming, um, the facilities are really nice, you know, I love swimming outdoors, the sun is really hot, you can see I'm dripping in sweat right now, <laughs> and we're out of the sun, so yeah, it's been awesome um, being here, uh, it's a bit of a change, you know, not many people maybe speak English, so it is a bit of a change, and I've had to start saying hola and, <laughs> and a few gla gla gracias here, here and there, so no, it, it's been good. <laughs>